hello. I hope this beautiful holiday weekend finds everyone well. So we're going to hop right into today's meditation and it is with the earthworm. So yeah, really excited for what this little one had to, to share with us. Hi Elizabeth. So go ahead and lower your eyes and come into your breath. Let's start with three nice deep inhales and exhales. Coming into your body, noticing any sensations in your body right now. And the earthworm is inviting us to find ourselves in earthworm bodies down in the soil. And to allow the soil for a moment to feel as if it is containing all the things that are stressing you out right now, burning you out, all the things that are tricky that kind of feel like pressure caving in, all the things that feel too big. And just for a moment come into contact with that sensation of like, ooh, this is uncomfortable, this is scary. I feel like I'm being caved in on. And then we're just very simply gonna switch it. And now feel the soil as an earthworm feels it, which is actually this huge abundance this knowing that there is food everywhere for you, there's a home everywhere for you, there's meaningful work everywhere for you to aerate the soil. And just wow, feel that expansiveness, like moving in the earth as an earthworm it's actually really delightful. And so how can you, from this perspective, view all the things going on around you as opportunities, as nourishment? And what does it look like to move through bite by bite, whatever challenges might be ahead of you, whatever ways you're stepping more into leadership or launching projects, whatever that may be, what does it feel like to just be you moving through that space? So the earthworm isn't going around creating compost thinking that it would, it should be a horse instead, that it should be anything other than what it is, where it is. And so finding acceptance for exactly where you are, the task at hand, moving through it, you've got this. And just Resting into the soil surrounding you, letting yourself be held by the earth. And there's an element of earthworm that also contains this idea of, you know, really stepping in and, and kind of having the courage to let your wisdom shine through a bit more, you know, that even the worms have things for us humans. So even you have things for other humans and animals and plants and the planet. So nothing is too small. No one is too small to make an impact. 
truly. So breathe into that. <laughs> How blessed we are. Mm. And so take one more deep, mindful breath in this space. And thank you so much for being here. Hi, Anne. Hi, Britta. I'm sure there's others whose names I can't see. I'm so grateful for you. Please, I'd love to hear anything in the comments of what came up for you with this journey. And as always, you're welcome to like the video, share it. And um, if you are tuning in on YouTube, you're welcome to follow me live on Facebook. These come up live, so find me over there. Thank you. Enjoy the rest of your of your weekend. Lots of love.